Good day, everybody. Today we are going to talk about logistic growth model. So without further ado, I'll share my screen with you. The logistic growth model problem. A population grows according to the logistic growth model with growth parameter r equal to 0.6, starting with an initial population given by p sub 0 equal to 0.7. Find P1, find P2, and part C, determine what percent of the habitat's carrying capacity is taken up by the third generation. So logistic equation is Pn plus 1, that is the n plus 1th population, is equal to R, which is the uh, growth parameter, multiplied by 1 minus P sub n, parenthesis, and the whole thing is multiplied by Pn. So for Pn plus 1, n is equal to, if we substitute n is equal to 0, then 0 plus 1 is 1. So P sub 1 is equal to R times 1 minus P0 multiplied by P0. Why? Because n is 0. That's how we are calculating P1 as a function of P0. So the growth parameter is 0 0.6 times, in parenthesis, 1 minus 0 0.7. Close the parenthesis, multiplied by P0, 0 0.7. That thing works out to 0 0.126. Hence, if we start with a population of P0 in the initial population as 0 0.7, the first generation population will be 0 0.126 with a growth parameter of 0 0.6. P2 similarly becomes is equal to R times 1 minus P1 multiplied by P1, which is 0.6 is the growth parameter multiplied by 1 minus 0.126. And the whole thing is multiplied by 0.126, which is 0 0.066. Hence, the second generation population is 0 0.066 when the initial population is 0.7 and the growth parameter is 0.6. Now we will calculate P3 in the same way. P3 is equal to R growth parameter multiplied by one minus P2 times P2, which is 0.6 times in parenthesis one minus 0 0.066 because P2 itself is 0 0.066 as we calculated in the prior step multiplied by 0 0.066, which works out to be 0 0.036, 0 0.03698, okay? Hence, 3.69% of the habitat's carrying capacity is taken up by the third generation, okay? That's a fancy way of saying what is the value of the population in the third parameter. I will stop here today. If you have any question, write me a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner because we change life with math education. Thanks for watching. Take care and I'll see you next time.